what's up? It's William from Rocket Zero and welcome to another Pixel Art Tutorial. In this video, we're going to be building Rayman that I got from FriendshipBracelet.net. So we're going to be using some white wool, black, magenta, yellow, red, orange, gray, and then some white hardened clay. So we're going to begin this Pixel Art by placing 10 blocks of our black wool. So here we go. Let's line up and... This, this should be good enough. I don't want to be too close. So yeah, we're going to place 10 black wool. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Then we're going to skip 2 blocks. And then place another 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Then we're going to go up by 2 blocks on each end. like so then what we're gonna do next is that we're gonna place a white we're actually gonna place two white walls and then a black a yellow and on top of this yellow we're gonna place six blocks towards the right so one two three four five six and then a whole row of yellow below so that we can place a black wool on the right and then finally, we're going to place a white here. And then another row of yellow towards the left. And then a white wool on the bottom. Hopefully I explained it well enough. I feel like I didn't. But just make sure that right here is going to be a row of six yellow wools. And then on the bottom is going to be a row of five yellow wools. So now let's go do the other shoe in the same way, but flipped. So on this side, we're going to go up by two white wools. Then place a black. Then we're going to grab our yellow wool and we're going to make a row of six yellow wool. So one, two, three, four, five, six. With a black wool on the right, six black wools on the top. And then below the six yellow wools, we're going to have five yellow wools. And then we can just fill in the rest with some white wool. So after we build something, I'm usually going to take a big step back. So you can use that time to maybe hit pause if you need to or just rewind if I went too fast. I do apologize if I end up going too quickly or too slow. It's just really difficult to like get a, pa a consistent pace. But hopefully, I'm doing a good enough job for you guys. If not, just let me know. I'm open to all sorts of criticism down below. So leave it in the comments. All right, so what we're going to do next is that we're going to grab one random block. Let's use a red for that. And we're going to go up by three blocks. So one, two, three. And on the right, we're going to go and play six black wool. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then three black wools going towards the left. And now we can delete this because I don't know if you guys ever played a Rayman game, which hopefully you have because it's a great game. The whole series is fantastic. Like, he's not connected. Those things are just floating around near him. So that's what we're trying to achieve. I always found that a bit funny, but I guess it gives him some like, I don't know. It, it's very iconic. Right, so over here, what we're going to do is so we're going to go up by three black wools. So there's going to be your three black wools. Then we're going to add one black wool and then one, two, three. So right here, we're going to go up by three. Then we're going to place one black wool. And on the side, we're going to stick three black wool. So make sure you guys have this shape. I would definitely recommend to pause whenever you need to, even though this is a even though we've done nothing. This is kind of a difficult shape right here. So I would definitely pause it here if you need to. Then we're going to add five white wools so one two three four five with five black wools on the well on the bottom not, on the, not in front of it but five black wools on the bottom and then four black wools on the side is that four there's one white wool two three four okay so that's four white wools then a black wool on top of those four white wools then what we're gonna do next is that next to this black we're gonna place Five white wools going towards the right. So one, two, three, four, five. And then five black wools across the top. And starting right here next to this white, we're going to go up by four. So one, two, three, four. Then we're going to place a red wool on the right. Then what we're going to do next is that right here, we're going to go up by two red wools. So one, two. Then place two black wools on the left and one on the top. And let's go ahead and add another red wool here and here as well. Because next to this black wool, we're going to add 
nine red wool. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We got a black wool on the right. And then nine black wools on top of those nine red wools. Then we need to add another row of red. So it's going to be right underneath it, going towards the left. Just apparently he has a scarf. I'm not sure, but that's just what the pit sword has. I don't remember him having a scarf, but yeah. <laughs> All right, so down here, or I guess up here, we're going to place two magentas with two black wools on the side. Then we're going to place three magentas with three black wools on the side. And then another three magenta with another three black wools on the side. Then we're going to place a black with two magentas and two black wools underneath that. So this is what we have so far. Positive you need to now would be a great stopping point in this video. What we're going to do next is that we're going to do that little design that he has going on in his stomach, which is just basically like a big letter O. So we're going to place another magenta. And on top of this magenta, we're going to go up by four white wools. Then we're going to place four white wools towards the left. So one, two, three, four. Then we're going to grab our magenta and we're going to place one, two, three. Again, one, two, three with one more magenta in the middle. Then we're going to add a white wool here. And then on top of this white that we just added, we're going to place four white wool towards the left. So one, two, three, four. So we can just connect these two guys, fill in this little spot, and we're left with something that looks like this. We still need to add just a little bit more detail. So for that, right here, we're going to add three white wools. So one, two, three. And in the bottom again, one, two, three. And there you go. Just like you see over there, we have it over here looking great. Now we're going to add this like arm with the little like pistol gun or whatever he has. I think it's just like a, he might be shooting a plunger. I'm not completely sure. Maybe like a grappling hook. All right. So for that, we're going to grab our white wool or a random block, which we're going to use red for that. And we're going to place four red wool towards the right. So one, two, three, four. So make sure you have four random blocks going towards the right. And then we're going to add five black wools on the right. One, two, three, four, five. Did I place five? Let me count. One, two, three, four. Oh, I need another one. So yeah, make sure that you have five black wools. Let's delete this random blocks. Then we're going to grab our gray wool. We're going to place one gray wool here. Then we're going to surround it with three blocks of our black wool. Then on top of this section, we're going to add a cube out of four white wools with two black wools on the side. Then right here, we're going to go up by four. One, two, three, four. Now starting on top of these two black wools towards the right, we are going to go ahead and place eight black wools. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then right here, we're going to go down by four. One, two, three, four. And we're just going to go ahead and fill this in with white wool. We should have actually done this at the end of the video, but I started it, so why not finish it? So there we go. That's going to be his fist. Now we're going to start building the gun. So for the gun, we're going to grab our black wool. And starting here, we're going to place two rows of three black wool. So one, two, three. One, two, three. Just like that. Then we're going to move on to the left. We're going to add a black wool here with two gray wools, then two black wools on the left side and two black wools on the top. And we're going to grab our gray wool. We're going to place one gray wool here. 
and we're gonna grab our black and we're gonna place three black holes on the top and then three black holes next to the gray and then starting right here again we are going to place what are we gonna place I gotta think for a second because I don't think we built this right we didn't crap let's fix it okay so make sure that you delete it so it looks something like this. I can't believe I made another mistake. I felt like I made a mistake recently in another video. I gotta stop doing that. But yeah, just make sure that it looks like this. I forgot to add a gray wool here, so I am so sorry. But feel free to call me an idiot down in the comments. I can take it. But dang it, I feel bad. But just make sure that it looks like this up to this point. Good thing we caught it now because it would have been embarrassing if I didn't. Alright, so now we're gonna add our three black wools. One, two, three. And one, two, three. So there we go. That took maybe one minute to fit, so hopefully I didn't waste too much of your time. I am sorry about it. So make sure that you guys have this. Then what we're gonna do next is that we are gonna grab our black wool and starting right here, we're gonna place five black wools towards the right. So one, two, three, four, five. Then we're gonna add a black wool. And four red pools on the bottom. One, two, three, four. And then we're gonna add another row of black pool directly on the bottom. It's gonna be made out of five black pools. So one, two, three, four, five. Now on the right of this like red pool, we're gonna add four black pools. So one, two, three, four. Then we're gonna add two red pools with two black pools on the top. Then next to this two red pools, we're gonna go up by four. So one, two, three, four. Then we're gonna add a red with two black pools on the top. A red, oops, a red with a black one on top. That wasn't red, that was yellow. But yeah, make sure it looks like this up to this point. I keep saying up to this point, but I'm not sure. Just make sure that it looks like this. That's all you need to worry about. Then what we're going to do again is that we're going to place over here two red wools with two black wools on the side and then four black wools across the top. So one, two, three, four. Then we're going to add two red wools with two black wools on the side. And now below this red wool on the left here, we're going to go down by five. So one two, three, four, five. Then over here we're gonna add two red wools so that we can add a red a black wool on the bottom and then a black wool on the right. Then let's add another two red so we can add a black on the right. Now, on the bottom of this red wool towards the right, we're going to place four black wools. So, one, two, three, four. Then we're going to place a red with a black wool on the right. And then the only thing we have left to do is that right here, we're going to place six red wools going up. So, one, two, three, four five sits and then sits more black wools on the side and that's gonna be the leader like plunger grappling hook gun or whatever you want it to be looks to me like it's he's shooting out those like plungers for like toilets so I'm not, I'm not sure what he what he's gonna be shooting with that but whatever this is what we have so far now let's go build the floating head so that for that floating head what we're gonna do is that we're gonna once again grab our red wool that we're using as a random building block and we're gonna place three red bulls here, one, two, three. And then starting on the top, we're gonna place four black bulls. Let's go ahead and move our white hardened clay closer, because that's gonna be pretty much the main block that we're gonna be using up to this point. And we can now go ahead and delete this three random blocks. We're gonna place a magenta, not a magenta, we're gonna place a white art and clay with three black wools on the top and six black wools going towards the right. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Then 
Then we're gonna place a white hardened clay with a black on the right. Then a white hardened clay with four black wools going up. One, two, three, four. And a white hardened clay with a black on the top. Now let's build just a little bit on the left. What we're gonna do so right here, we're gonna place three diagonal black wools going up and towards the left. So here we go. One, two, and three. Then we're gonna grab our white heart in place and we're gonna go up by three. One, two, three. With three black wools on the side and four black wools going straight up. One, two, three, four. Then we're going to place a black hole here and three black holes going up. One, two, whoops, two, three, just like that. Then on the side here, we're going to place one, two, three, four, five, six white wools. Then we're going to grab our black. We're going to place one, whoops, one, two, three and again one two three with four black wools then we're gonna add two white wools with a black on the top and on the left of this black we're gonna add three white wools we're gonna grab our black we're gonna place one black here and then three black wools across the top Then we're going to grab our white, we're going to place two white wools with two black wools on the top and then four black wools on the bottom in the shape of a cube. And then starting right here, we're going to go up by five. One, two, three, four, five with two black wools on the right. And then down here, we're going to add five black wools towards the right. So one, two, three, four, five. And God dang it, look at this. Another mistake. I am so sorry, but this one should be pretty easy to fix. All right. So after we have our five black wools towards the right, I'm so upset. Why do I keep messing up? No. <laughs> All right. So back down here, we're going to add two more black wools. So this ends up being three. Then we're going to place a white hardened clay with a black on the right. And up here we're going to place a white hardened clay with a black on the right. And then we're going to connect this with one, two, three, four, and four black holes on the side. So that took no time at all to fit. But I'm very ups upset with myself because that's two mistakes in one video. But I mean, I was kind of looking at my phone because somebody texted at me, so... I guess I kind of messed up there. So that's my apologies. I am very sorry. But that took no time at all to fix. All right. So now back to Raymond. Let's do his hair because his hair is really like wild and whatnot. So for that, what we're going to do is that up here, we're going to add an orange. And then we're going to add a black hole on the bottom with three black holes going up. Then we're going to add a red with three black holes. One, two, three. Then over here, we're going to add an orange with a black, an orange with a black, so it's three diagonal black wools. Then we're going to add a black, uh, not a black, I'm sorry. Why did, did I call this black? It's going to be an orange with a red, not a black. But yeah, uh, this is such a messy video. All right, so then we're going to place a red wool on the left here. And then an orange with a red on the top, and then an orange with a red on the top and on the left. So here you have three diagonal wools, then another three diagonal wools, and then we have this one more on the left. We're gonna grab our yellow wool, we're gonna place a yellow wool with a black on the left. Not a black, a red on the left, oh my god. Then down here we're gonna go down by four red wools. So one, two, three, four, and a red wool on the left. Let's go ahead and fill this in with some orange wool. 
just because we need to. Then over here we're going to add an orange with a red on the top, two orange wools with three red wools on the top, and two on the side like so. Then we're going to place an orange with a black on the left and an orange, not a black, a red on the left. And then an orange with a red on top of the orange. I don't know why I keep calling this black. What's wrong with me? And over here, we're going to add a yellow with three black wools surrounding it. And now let's just fill this in with some orange wool. Now we're going to grab our black on the left side over here and we're going to go up by three. One, two, three, a yellow, and then up by two, one, two. Then we're going to place a yellow with a black wool. Then we're going to place three yellow wools with two black wools and three black wools across the top. Then over here we're going to go upwards and towards the right by two black wools with a yellow underneath. So one, two, that's going to be our two diagonal black wools. Then we're going to place a yellow with a red with two black wools on the top and one on the side. And then we're going to place a yellow with two black wools on the right. And then a yellow with one diagonal black wool. And now we're finally done. Only made two mistakes. That's so terrible. But hopefully you guys persevered with me. And we finished building Rayman from a bunch of different Ubisoft games. The only thing you guys have left to do is just to fill this part of the gun with some gray wool. This part of his body with some magenta. The fist white. The face with a white hardened clay. And then the top of his hair with some yellow wool. So I'm gonna park it right here so you guys can see how exactly you need to fill it in. But it's pretty simple, not that many colors. And that's it guys, I am so sorry for messing up a couple times, but if we both stuck through it, I'm sure we both did it all right. So this is the finished product. So thank you so much for sticking with me, even though I messed up. And that's pretty much it. I cannot say sorry enough, but thank you so much for watching this video. We really do appreciate it. Tell your friends about us. Feel free to leave a comment down below telling us what you want me to build next. Subscribe if you haven't so you can stay up to date with all our newest videos and as always thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.